Hey everyone, Living in Furnace Furnace here. <clears throat> I just recorded this and I forgot that I had to turn on the, the game viewing thing on my computer, which I forgot the last time, did, like when I tried to get to the, 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 sweet, the Lugia place. And I apologize for that uh, in, in hindsight. So, Infernus got Flamethrower from level 60, Sunny Day from TM18, and then there's uh, Pollen with um, Solar Beam. I, I guess, I don't know if it'll be useful. I think I might just change it out. I don't know. I gotta think about that one. Thinking, thinking. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna replace it with something. Jackalogus is uh, probably going to be useless, so I'll, I'll switch that out to uh, Delibird. Good, I guess. Suicune, I, I so Suicune can come in handy. I got it. Uh, I'm going to have to get it some uh, HMs in order to get the items in the place up ahead. So let me just go through here. Uh, let me see here. I might, uh, you know what, I maybe should keep Leer. Yeah, that would be a great idea, actually. You never know what could use a good Leer. Okay, and then let me make sure I'm recording. Yes, indeed. And then Gust can go. That's fine. I don't really care about that. And check my pack. So I should have um, I should have healing items, but I don't. <clears throat> All right, uh, Infernus, I guess. Infernus is gonna be my MVP, my best Pokemon around. So up to here, I'm going to. Uh, let me see here. Does this have... Yeah, it has Flash. Oh, well. I lost... Uh, I got rid of Synthesis, which is kind of unfortunate, really. It's like its signature move, in a way. Ah, I want to select uh, 11. That should be plenty. And a Revives 2. I wonder if Suicune can use Flash. I forget. Uh, cause Suicune, you know, Suicune's a good Pokemon, right? Not able. Mmm. Okay. Well, let's just fly on back. We're at the Silver Cave, and I can just switch out. Cause I, uh, I realize that my Pokemon team is not so good. I mean, I granted, I did manage to to get to the big battle and defeat it, win, and but um, it just didn't work out. I, I I feel like Pollen might have some uses. I don't know, Jackalogus, no point. No hope for Jackalogus. Oh no no, I'm sorry, but the puns will not save us. A bead, I, I don't know. It's just because Bead has been in so many battles, let's <clears throat> let's just bring Pulte back in there. There are one or two Pokemon that Pulte is fantastic against, so look forward to that. Um, let me just get a good TM. <laughs> uh, Dream Eater could work. Sort of. Let's see here. Yeah, mean look is gonna be useless. Alright. Yeah, I think this is a good plan. This is a good setup. Um Yeah. Mm hmm I think we're good. Let's whip out that um 
Max Repel. <clears throat> and head on up. Uh, oh, it doesn't even say. Mount Silver. Alright, let me get the guide for one more time, shall we? I shall. Max, wait, no, no, no. I need to, uh, use Flash. If you want to explore the, in, uh, the e entire interior of Mount Silver, you'll need to take along Pokemon that know, uh, what is this? Protein. Dang it, I have so many items. So many items. You know what? Actually, this this X special could come in handy, come to think of it. Uh, I, I'll, I'll have to use more of those. Elixir, I'm, I'm thinking maybe that, or this. Uh, that can go. This can go for sure. And... Yeah, actually, Pulte would be great with a focus band for sure. And, uh, Magnet. Yeah, whatever. I don't use electric types, no, or do I, um, <clears throat> use steel. I was trying to sing along to that, but my throat is kind of achy. I might have a sort of cold going on, it's kind of hard to tell. Uh, protein, uh, shucky, I guess. Um, the only, the issue is that, like, one of my co-workers, um, I have a job, by the way, check that out, so there's that, um, check me out, uh, so there's that, uh, I am proud of that, it's pretty cool, and one of my co-workers was sick, and she got sick, like, a few days ago, it kind of feels like maybe I am sick, and maybe I'm in just in good enough mood to handle it, well, I don't know, uh, I think I'll be fine. I mean, it's just a cold. It's, it's just fine, you know, whatever. Um, so yeah, Max Elixir. That, that can be useful. Did I get a hidden item in here? I think there was a, um... Yeah, I, I, I missed something, actually. There was a hidden item uh, a little down south of here, so let me just get around to that. Or I could just tell you, yeah. So... You see the rock over, uh, over on the uh, the left, I think it is. No, wait, the right side, or the left side, because it's mirrored, or something. Basically, one of the rocks there is it has a dire hit. Uh, will I need it? I think I'll be fine. I think I'll be fine. All right, the music's back on. We are ready to jam. Like, j jam up waterfalls. Yeah. It says here, you'll need to take along Pokemon that knows Flash, Surf, and Waterfall. I just forgot to read the thing. The Pokemon inside the mountain are very strong. If you're having trouble with the wild Pokemon, you're definitely not ready for the final showdown with a person waiting at Mount Silver's summit. Train hard. Mount Silver is actually in Johto, but you can walk to it only from Kanto. Uh, after you've visited Mount Silver once, you can fly back to it from Johto. So, here we are. Got some pretty good items. How about that, huh? Along here. So the Pokemon out here are pretty interesting. You got Ursa Ring, you know, kind of similar to, well, Teddy Ursa that you'd be able to find uh, on the hills of, uh, or mountainsides of uh, Route 46, I think. Uh, so that's kind of an interesting parallel of sorts. Uh, and also we have, um, what else do we have? There's Magmar, but I think it's only in Crystal. And, of course, there's there's gonna be plenty of Golbat. Ah, uh, here we go, a Calcium. So, uh, yeah. Uh, let's grab that Calcium. And give it to, uh, Pulte. Oh, right, it's Pulte, I think. 
I thought that was the other Pokemon that I had forgotten, that, um, Bead. But Bead is, you know, Bead, Bead has been in the spotlight enough. And while I'd like to put Jackalogus back into the spotlight, <laughs> Jackalogus is just not that useful. It was only good, really, against, like, you know, trainers, just body slamming things. But at this point in the game, when you got a tough trainer up ahead, that just will not work. That will not suffice. We need better Pokemon. So here we go. Red. The central trainer of from Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, known in Crystal, Gold, and Silver as Red, is the game's toughest trainer. His Pokemon are all level 70 or higher. Try to attack fast and hard. The longer the match drags on, the lower your chance of winning. Your Pokemon should be level 50 or higher. Uh, but I think I'll be fine <laughs> with the way they are. I think. I am not the best at thinking sometimes, but you know, we'll see what happens. You know, in hindsight, I should probably have light screen, because the next Pokemon... Uh, Pikachu is weak. I... <laughs> I'm sorry, Pikachu, but a good earthquake will just take care of any Pikachu. Um, this is kind of the scariest part, and like, cause, well, if you have an Umbreon, you probably don't have to worry. Uh, there, there's an interesting thing where there's some Pokemon that have like attacks that like have um, immunities. Like Pokemon can be immune to them. So you could maybe catch a dark type in Kanto and bring it here and just like a little baby hound hour or something and just defeat this thing, but um, I'll, I'll have to figure something out here. Maybe, maybe just roast it, you know? Uh, do I have pollen? I have pollen. Pollen probably not be able to take a... Um, an attack. Oh my, reflect. <laughs> what, you think I'm gonna earthquake you when I have Infernus here ready to roast? So, a couple of those should do it. Uh, I can take a psychic, that's fine, I think. Yeah, it's fine, I guess. Um, I don't really have a fast Pokemon with which to hit this hard and fast. Uh, oh dear. Um, Eddie can probably... I don't think Eddie can take a hit. Um... I wanted to press B there, okay. Um, Shucky can take a hit. And I think uh, I think a little little rollout will finish the job. I guess probably like round up and attack. Uh, the only issue is that if I'm rolling, I'm gonna be on a roll, and that will not stop until I roll away and get washed away. Cause this guy has a water type. Oh, good grief! Well, I should have expected that at some point. A Suicune might be able to take a Psychic, but I kind of doubt it. Let's find out. Well, what do... what... what I mean, what do I expect, you know? Alright, Pulte just... Pulte can just take a hit while I heal up. Um, I got, I got some, uh, some Max Revives, how about that, <laughs> after losing three Pokemon already. That's kinda concerning. Hopefully I'll be able to get through this battle just with the Max Revives, I'll, I'll try. I'll try to think. I need to think better about these things, you know? You'll be back, Pulte. Oh, well, actually, yeah, and, and then I'll be using uh, some regular a regular revive for Pulte, come to think of it. Um, I'll just flamethrower. Um, 
And then we got another Pokemon, which means, uh... Maybe I should have brought Bead. Maybe. Yeah, I, I think I should have. Cause this thing's gonna... Ready to, to wash us away. Let's see here. What can I use against that? Uh, Eddie, maybe? I'll be faster so I can put up a sunny day. Uh, Infernus will just go down in the surf anyway. But that can buy me some time. Uh, maybe do a good um, solar beam. Because I got solar beam. And I think that'll be going first and strong and all that because it's sunny. So let's go for it. Yep. Come on, Pollen. I expected more. So that, that that's a scary move. <laughs> um. Let me think. Suicune, maybe? No, I... Mm, I don't know. This I, I can go down to, like, one blizzard, so... Infernus will have to do... It's still sunny out, so I can maybe use a good, um... Oh, okay. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Uh, Suicune is gonna... I think Suicune will need to be full HP. So, let's just bring it right back up and take that blizzard. Missing again. Okay, well, I'll just take that this opportunity to, uh... Use the regular revive on Pulte. For later. Alright, uh, give it a present, I guess. I think Surf will finish us off, actually. I think I should have not brought Eddie Joseph. I, I thought I thought it being much higher level than uh, than Bead would be better, but I think Bead would be would have been way better here. So let's try some sunny day just to reduce that damage. Uh, heal up, maybe. Um, I can do two flamethrowers, which is great, and I think that might do it. Um, maybe. I mean, Infernus is strong, but Blastoise is also quite strong. Hmm. Uh, that means that the next one's gonna do it. Alright, sunny day again. I I'm, I'm really disappointed in, in Pollen. Like, I mean, I, I should have expected it. Jump Bluff is just not a great Pokemon. Also, I have the, the team... Let me just open up... Uh, don't save that. There we go. And th that That's a little better. I mean, showing more of the team, I guess. Alright, do a flamethrower and hope for the best, I guess. I can probably be faster than it with a Pokemon I have. Dare I try it? I think I might try it. Um, yeah, maybe. Suicune can take a hit against this. Uh, I think Nightshade is probably best. Ow! Oh! Ow! Oh! Why? Why do you do this to me, game? No, oh, what do I expect? The, the, the guide literally says to bring Pokemon that are like level 50 or higher at, at a minimum. <sighs> I might as... No, I... 
Well, yeah, I, I should revive something, I guess. Pulte's gonna have to be around. We're, we're gonna need you, Pulte. Come on, pal. Whirlpool? Okay. I, I, I wonder, is... Do we have rain? We have sunlight. I think I better just take this time to max survive. At the very least, Infernus can hit first and, and just defeat this thing if Suicune gets knocked out, which I kind of doubt, because that's what it's all about. I don't think Suicune is faster than, uh, than uh, Blastoise. So, there's that. Surf it! Oh. Alright, this might be... This might do us in. Oh, that was close. That was close, close, close. I think a good surf, though, might do it. Just, just enough. Let's see. Ah, come on! That's not fair. Alright, well, time to use an item, I guess. Um, Shucky, Shucky's good. Shucky, I think I'll need. I, I think I'll need Shucky. Oh yeah. Oh, you better believe I'll need Shucky. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, it looks like it's another one for uh, Infernus again. After all this time, yet again. Alright, Earth, just, just, I could've used Strength there. Just something different, not so much, uh, not so shaky. I just remembered something about the Snorlax, um... But I have an idea. So, this thing has only normal type attacks. I, I, let me see if Nightshade works. Nightshade does not affect en enemy Snorlax. Okay, that's fine. I sh oh, you know what? I should have Spite. This would be a great time for Spite. <laughs> because this thing cannot hit me. Uh... Wow, the game literally decided to not attack. That's very cool. And, uh, yeah, that's... That's something. Alright. Maybe I'll use Hypnosis. Um... Oh, I don't have Pollen. Dang it, I need Pollen. Pollen needs to be, uh, ready to battle. Um, alternatively, I can use Shucky. Nothing wrong with a Shucky. And, uh... A phone call? For me? How... How kind! No, how rude. Okay, where was I? Uh, oh yeah. So, time to use Flash, I guess. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, this thing's gonna defeat me. Yeah, I think so. So, I think I sh I should- I should've used Rest. So, I'll just put this thing to sleep. Um, or see what it does. Um... I could use Dream Eater kind of pointlessly and waste its turns. I feel like I might need those four Dream Eaters, though. Uh, let's see. Let me just put it to sleep. It will do a snore. But I think I'll be... F no, I won't be faster. I, I don't know. I don't know. 
Um, yeah, it has snore. Well, it did miss. Alright, I need to rest. For sure. The need to rest is very serious. There we go. Now we're all sleeping. Sleepy babies. Sleepy tanks, as they're called. Because they're so big and... Or so tough to fight, you know. So high in defense or HP or what have you. Um, snore hurts a bit, and I don't like that. But what are you gonna do? I'll wake up soon, I guess, and I can use flash, I guess. Uh, I should also probably um, get ready for pollen. Uh, maybe one more. There we go. Blinding lights. Okay. Uh, time to get into the bag. Revive again. Pollen. I don't actually have a lot more time for this. So, pollen then uh, needs to go out. Uh, that missed. Great. Uh, leech seed is important. Might as well toxic while I'm out. Uh, do a solar beam, I guess? I don't know. This isn't working. Alright. At this point, I'm wasting my time. <sighs> yeah, let's just use strength. I mean, that thing has, like, so much amnesia that it can't think anything. It feels no pain. Uh, and strength doesn't hurt it that much. Maybe... And come to think of it, I did have a, an X special, but that's fine. Uh, I think I'll go without it. <laughs> I should probably go for earthquakes. Oh my god, no! Why do you do this? Why do you have to do this to me? Alright, come on, Infernus. Just, just do a critical hit. That's probably it. Okay. Now we got Charizard. Um, I'll sacrifice Pollen and Pulte. Wow, just a wing attack. Well, Charizard's a strong Pokemon. What I'm trying to do here is realize that I need to have um, Suicune. And it's not faster, which means I need to heal. Um, and that's fine, I think. So, Infernus will have to take hits. Um, oh, I had, I had rare candies that I had forgotten about. Alright. Fire spin, okay. Not that much damage, so there's, so there's that. <laughs> Uh, I do need a spare Pokemon just in case I lose a bit too much. Eddie will have to do. I mean, Eddie is just kind of pointless this battle. So, there's that. It's it's really unfortunate because Eddie Joseph really pulled it through for the uh, for the big battle. But I can't I can't even switch out here. So, yeah, there's that. Suicune. So here's the idea. I need to use Rain Dance, at least, and then reduce the damage from the fire type attacks. Might take a couple of uh, wing attacks and that'll do me in, but at least I can have the power of rain by my side now, and thus uh, do some more damage with uh, Surf. Um, 
If you notice me shaking a little bit, I'm, I'm just kind of itchy. I got a scratch, an itch that I am scratching. Alright, let's see. I think this will do a third, maybe. Okay. Yeah, and down we go. Okay. Um, a it might take more than two rollouts, I'm afraid, to get past this Charizard. Ah, but I can take a few, maybe even, yeah, two more for sure. So let's see, are we on a roll, or am I gonna get the troll of uh, losing that 10% chance? It's worked out okay, okay. I can miss once and I can go for it again. That's fine. Maybe I can I, I can still take one uh, flamethrower. Can, we, we we can we can get through this. Gotta stay strong. It's not strong enough apparently. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to use the Hyper Potion. Infernus, I think it's all you. Eddie's down. Uh, Pollen is up. Use that. Pollen is down. Infernus, strength. I don't think that'll do too much. Ooh! Okay! Um, that doesn't really change my plans. The Charizard goes down to a strength. That's what I like to see. Almost level 61. That is nice, I guess. But not really what I wanted. Anyway, we're, I'm gonna need to use this. Just, just heal up. In Furnace, um, let's see what move. Hmm. Is there anything I can do? I don't think that'll defeat me, right? I mean, it's a strong move, but I'm a fire type, right? <laughs> Can't be that bad. I kind of thought this this thing would have like pedal dance or something. Might be a little more interesting. All right, here we go. Now we take a solar beam. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. What move to finish it with? Strength, I guess. We've already had some shaking and baking. So let's just smash it up. Oh, synthesis. You know what? Let, let, let's, let's play around, shall we? I want to beat this thing in one hit. How about that for a conclusion? Yeah, let's, let's put up some sunny days. Take a solar beam, that's fine. Okay, I kind of hoped that it would do, um, you know, um, a synthesis again, but even if it did, this flamethrower would have defeated that level 77 Venusaur. Number three is now just a number that's defeated, I guess. It's not the best pun, but it's, it's like number three in the Pokedex, like it's you know, the evolved form of Bulbasaur number one's pretty cool. Now, ah, those are some big numbers. Red is, yet again, speechless. I mean, honestly, I probably would be too. <laughs> if I got defeated like that. <laughs> and now credits. So, um... I've been um, thinking about what to do. I, I guess I'll do a channel update because uh, I've already had a lot of thoughts about this game. Not really my favorite Pokemon game, but I felt like maybe I should get into it because um, I have the guide. And you can see, like that's that's it. Like there's the the Pokedex right after that whole dungeon place. Um, 
my guide's really falling apart too. You can see, like, this is the first page it's got. I had to staple part of it to hold it together. Pretty cool guide, though. It's got, like, an item list. And I think it's got a move list, too. Uh, it's got, uh, kind of like the locations of Pokemon and how rare they are. It's kind of vague in that way. I mean, it doesn't really distinguish between a 10% and a 1%. But there's that. And, uh, next will, um, be the, uh, ramping up Rayman Legends, I think. And then we got, um... Pokemon Shining Pearl. Uh, the idea, I guess, would be to be uh, the darkness fighting the, the light, I guess, because I like the shining light, because I'm going to be using dark types. Uh, and until I do, uh, until I really get into that, I'll be using a Pokemon that can bite. And, um, and that'll be pretty interesting. Mostly. And, Pretty much almost all of it sort of will be without commentary. I've talked enough about this, you know, how the game works, critical hits and all that, uh, strategies. So you can just, um, you know, see how it is and, uh, you know, maybe play it in like faster uh, speed, perhaps. <sighs> wow. Over, over 30 minutes, or over 35 minutes, really. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, gonna be it, you just push A, it's not one of those, oh, that's it, we're done, it's actually, that's it, like, uh, you just show back up, and you can continue, really. So, um, that's gonna be it, that's all for Pokemon Crystal, with my strange team, with Shuckle, and, uh, and, uh, the the um, skip loom. I, I, I still, I still have it called a skip loom. I can't believe it. After all this time, I am so sorry. I don't even pay attention to things. Uh. Well, that's that's a that's a funny that's a punchline. If if I ever done seen one. So, uh, that'll be it for the series, uh, stay tuned for, um, Pokemon Shining Pearl, maybe Wind Waker, maybe eventually, uh, Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts, I'd really like to get to that game specifically, cause, you know, kinda fits in with my theme, like my, my mascot kinda, you know, the, the race car, or, I mean, sports car thing in the game, so there is that. But, um, otherwise, uh, oh, and, and maybe also some, uh, Grand Theft Auto, GTA, just, you know, just driving around, you know, in the sports car, watching the sunsets and palm trees and whatever, you know, that got that, uh, California setup going on, so, that will be that, so look forward to that, goodbye.